Well, hello, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to do an unboxing. I've uh, got a couple of things to do today, but we're gonna start out with uh, Kiryakin backrest. You can see here, I've got the box here. Now, just for information, I have an 08 Goldwing and I already have the Kiryakin backrest, but it's extremely old and it's got some problems. The zipper on the back here, you can see is all broke and the pouch is open. And when we went on our trip last year, my daughter, nothing to do on the ride and she picked all of the leather off here. So it's getting kind of worn. It doesn't adjust right and it kind of kind of didn't do what it's supposed to. It's been on there since the previous owner. So I thought I would upgrade and get a brand new one and have all of my adjustments, have it all looking nice, the back all working well. So here we go, we're gonna unbox it. Um, I guess before I start, I should say too that uh, I'm not affiliated with Kiryakin. They didn't send this to me. I got this off of Amazon. Um, something I did all on my own, so uh, we're gonna unbox it now. I'm gonna set this down so I can get over here and unbox. Okay. I'm gonna open her up here. Pull it all out. Looks like I got my my power stuff here or my hardware and of course the backrest which is nice because it's all comes already put together Put all that over there now we're gonna Uncover it all, get it all opened up here. Like the instructions are here with the seat. Got all the instructions, get it all uncovered. And then we'll uh, start putting it together. All right, we got it all unboxed. You can see here, got everything unwrapped. And comes, of course, with the backrest. And the bar, these are the side bars. Comes with the screws. I'll be using three of them. One of them I won't, we'll get into later. And the instructions here. So we've got the instructions. I'm gonna read them. And then I'll come over and I'll take off my old backrest and we'll start the install of the new one which is pretty simple it's just going to be four screws and we should be good to go it's just getting it adjusted and since i've already used it i already know what my adjustment's going to be so i take the old one off and look at those adjustments and then get the new one on and we'll be back okay i read through the instructions and it's telling me, of course it's not assuming I already have one of these on my bike, it's telling me to remove the handles on both sides, which is the four screws. And they're a six millimeter wrench is what I've got here. So I'm going to remove those now and then we'll put the, the new bars on and then we'll work on getting that on. Okay, I just had a side note here. I've taken off the handle on this side, and that would be the left side, as if you're standing at the back of the bike. And I'm coming over to the other side, and I said before, I'm only using three of the screws because I actually have a cup holder here, and it came with its own screw, which is you have to take this cup holder off here, 
and then you can get to the screw which is longer than the others that they had so I'll be taking that off next and then I'll have the backrest off and we'll install the new plates all right as you can see I've got the handles off the old backrest is off over here laying here I put the three old screws here with the old backrest I left the one long screw and that is the little bar that goes on for my uh, cup holder and it just takes a pair of pliers and now we're ready to uh, put the new plate on right here put the plate on each side but first I'm going to wipe down the side clean it all off really good and we're getting really close to probably already being done okay I've got the the sides on and the handles back on as you can see there's nothing to it a couple of screws but just kind of show step by step as I go got my cup holder back on that's on now we'll be ready to install the actual backrest and then we should be done okay I've made sure I read the uh, instructions because mine was a little rusted and didn't work quite right but it's very simple you've got three mounting holes depending on how far forward or back you want depending on your back I'm gonna go all the way forward because I already know that's my mounting thing and when you put these in as you can see here this will actually rotate so once you spring them into their holes right here you can see it's kind of a tear shaped so when you turn it it locks it in so it makes it really easy to come on and off so I'm gonna go ahead and put that on and then I'll show you the final result okay well I'll finish that installation you can see I moved it to the very front because of course I have arthritis in my back and I want to keep that up as close and on my back as I can I did try the middle hole it was just too far back for me so that's the installation very simple very easy of course we, nothing hard about it and makes the bike look better my pouch is new now it's got a, a nice look to it makes everything look brand new on the bike so That'll finish the installation of the Kiriakin backrest, and we'll go on to our next project.